I've got an antique Singer Lotus in a parlor cabinet. I'm going to pull the machine out, show you how to remove it, and then uh, we're going to do the stitch test on it. Um, it's from 1907. The serial number is H1326209. These are my favorite cabinets. Uh, this one has a push button release for popping the machine up like that, which is pretty cool. These doors pop in then. There's a latch under here, just pull it forward so it locks your machine up into place. Push the rear doors out for your feet and uh, make sure our treadle cord is on. Alright, there we go. There's also an access door here and another door here with the drawers. One really cool thing is uh, this comes with the attachment tray with all the attachments except for the needle case. Uh, that's pretty rare. And also the full large size manual dated 1907. I'm going to pause the uh, camera for a minute and then uh, we're going to so I can set it up so you'll see the stitch test. Alright, now we're going to we're going to do a stitch test. You can see this is the Lotus Thistle uh, decals. There's some wear on the bed. Uh, chrome pieces are in pretty good condition with it being 1907. There's things with a dated plate. Bobbin winder with a large wheel that rides a treadle cord. Uh, and also the bobbin case is slightly different from the 1910 version everyone's used to with the uh, red eye decals. Basically I have six layers of denim. They're already stitched once. A photo in the ad. And just to show you how well it stitches. Doing a full speed stitch test because that's the only way to tell if you're going to miss stitches or broken threads. The cabinet's pretty good condition. It's missing a little piece on the back side. Um, hopefully we'll be able to see these stitches. A little piece of the veneer is off on the back side and then there's a good size scratch. There you can see pretty good. And there's the, uh, there's the stitch and there you have it.